What's up, everybody? This is Master Ian Gamer, and welcome to another Overwatch live stream. Today is the big day. Oh, we got the big game coming up later today. Ooh, boy. Can't wait to watch that one team fight the other team. It's it's the day of the year. Woo! Hope you all are excited as me. How are y'all doing, folks? Let me bring this thing up. I hope you all are having a lovely Sunday. Super Bowl Sunday. Hello, Peter. Hello, P. Daddy. Impersonation Lol Slayer. <laughs> Raphael. Hopefully not the turtle. Avon, welcome one and all. Welcome Lyric. Armon. Kiarg. I, I don't know how to say your name. I hope you are having a lovely day, everybody. One and all. I am here late once again. This time it wasn't my fault. I swear, my uh, my microwave exploded. <laughs> true story. <laughs> well, true to the extent that it stopped working. So I haven't eaten yet today, so that'll be fun. Um, anyways, I hope you all are having a lovely day. Super Bowl later, I wanted to squeeze in some Overwatch competitive matches before the big game. So here we are. I didn't try to microwave a spoon, Pete Eddie. I know better than that. Good gosh. Here's about the Super Bowl and we have the Puppy Bowl. <laughs> oh my god, I remember the Puppy Bowl. Yeah, that that was that that is that still a thing? It wouldn't surprise me if it was still a thing, but god, I remember that when I was like pretty young. That was like a thing. That was on what, Animal Planet? My god. All right. I don't think we really have any reason to hang around here in the Kanazaka Mall for the time being. So let's just get ready to slide on over to Overwatch. Oh, also, uh, I've adjusted how audio is handled in my streams a little bit. So if any of you notice any like weird audio funny business, like things sound like really off in terms of like volume or like the game just doesn't have audio or something like that let me know in the chat and i'll try to resolve it because I, I did sort of readjust how my audio has been working that'll hopefully make it easier to manage during the stream but anyways on that note i'm going to shimmy on over Let's see if we can. Okay, I think we're going to be good to go. All right. No sense in warming up. We're going to hop straight into competitive. After all, we've only got a couple days left until we can't get golden weapons for an entire year. Exciting, isn't it? Hello, Pixel Ghost. Welcome to the stream. Good to see ya. Yes, we are super bowling indeed. It is the big day after all. Everyone's excited. Oh, I'm actually curious to see if this 
So the Super Bowl is going to impact like Overwatch competitive matches. Are Overwatch competitive players into football? Are they going to be busy pre-gaming? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. How do you like the new Moira Mythic skin? I think it looks pretty cool. We'll have to see it in game, though, of course, as always. All right, we can just go into deathmatch while we sit here doing nothing. Welcome to Blizzard Realm. I miss getting to play Wrecking Ball. It's been so long. Alright. Ooh, I got put on support. Interesting. Alright. I think this might be the first time I've ever done like a Sunday daytime stream. This will be interesting. Curious to see who all shows up. Also, you know, it's a big day, <laughs> at least in America, so I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of people are busy today. These folks. Oh my god, why did I bother stepping off? Survive, Torb! No! Man, we just can't get out of this little room, can we? go now i'm just gotta get the mercy ah, there we go ah Ugh, thank god used to be working on the super bowl day and it's always packed people buying their chips and alcohol feels good not to be working today oh yeah yeah i bet there is a lot of like convenience store and grocery store type stuff going on people trying to get last minute chips and dip that sort of stuff 
It occurred to you yesterday that you're not fully sure where the Symmetra event background place is on this map. Probably because you don't go backwards into the spawn room. Uh, I think that actually might be a completely different map. In terms of, like, that's its own room. That's not actually physically part of this map. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, what? It's weird how excited people get over a couple people throwing a ball around. What do you mean, Tinte? It's the big game. It's the most exciting thing that's ever happened in our lives. It's incredible. How could you not be excited about it? Yeah, I don't have a good feeling about this match. <laughs> see Widowmaker kick Zen. Yeah, I mean, that was the PvE version of the map for that scene specifically, so that's definitely not part of this map. Zen kicked Widow. Well, that actually makes more sense considering that he has snap kick. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> it does seem a bit backwards, doesn't it? Zen should be the one kicking, not Widow. Pesky mm. Genji. Just did some battle mercy and it worked out. Team was actually backing you. Wow. Wonder why. What if Kiri kicked you? All right, now I feel like that's going into a, a territory we maybe don't want to delve into here. So uh, uh, maybe tone it back a bit, Pixel Ghost, you know? Just straight up asked you to be your Valentine. I I don't know what to tell you, Pixel Ghost. Uh, you, you're you're allowed to have whatever little little fun ideas you want, but uh, <laughs> I, I I don't know what to say. <laughs> oh, you're saying the uh, background could have been on the PVE version, potentially. For that, I'd almost not be surprised if it was just its own standalone, like, mini environment, like they do for a lot of the, like, background menus. I think the next season is Egypt themed because the Venture and the Symmetra Mythic skin. Uh, I do think season 10 is going to be Egyptian themed. 
I think it's going to be Ramatra, though, who gets the mythic. He's going to get, like, an Anubis-themed mythic skin. Because, like, we already know he had an Anubis-themed design originally. I think that's what they're going to do for him. Gosh darn it. Yeah, I don't know. This uh This match was just not in our favor. Careful. We're outnumbered. Can't see any new characters getting into the mythic until a few more seasons in cuz of free to play. Yeah, Kiriko had one. Uh Junker Queen had one. I don't think that necessarily limits it. Hey, Bumblebee, welcome to the stream. Yes, most balanced flashpoint. I don't think necessarily it's going to be following the pattern of tank DPS support for the next three. I think it's mainly, I think probably the two, like, factors are no roll will get a tank, or no roll will get a mythic skin twice in a row, and no uh, roll will get a second mythic until every roll has had one. So, like, theoretically, I think it could be either a DPS or a tank in Season 10. But I think it's going to be... Actually, no, no. I do think it's going to be a tank because I think it's going to be Ramatra with an Anubis-themed Mythic skin. So, you know, it will be tank regardless. But after that, it could potentially be a support instead of another damage. We'll have to wait and see. Kinda need to do new heroes pretty often, otherwise years from now all the original cast will have been done. Let's be honest, I don't think we're ever gonna reach a point where uh, every hero has a mythic skin. <laughs> Didn't somebody calculate that it'd take like nine years or something like that? Someone did the math, it would take over 10 years, it wouldn't be until 69 where every hero has a mythic skin. Yeah, um... 
I mean, unless they stopped adding new mythic skins at some point in seasons. I'll be honest, when they said, oh, you'll be able to get old mythic skins again for future battle passes, part of me was like, is that their, like, subtle way of saying we're going to stop making new mythic skins? <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. Or unless they stop adding new heroes. Yeah, yeah. What settings do you have for your communication wheel? Uh, these? And then I just have ping on middle mouse button. Just had to run out of ammo. How long are we expecting Overwatch 2 to be supported until 3? I don't know. I mean, it is a live service game. I think more likely they're gonna, rather than having like an Overwatch 3 at any point, they're just gonna keep like rebooting the game in a sense with things like what we're seeing happen in Season 9. Where it's like, we decided to massively tweak everything just because. Which, speaking of, I'm curious, what are y'all thoughts on uh, what they've said thus far about the Season 9 changes? A lot of people seem to have a lot of very strong opinions about it, so... They <laughs> just can't hit each other. <laughs> yeah. Could be interesting. Yeah. Certainly could. I think the changes are too big to know until we actually play it. I agree. Yeah, that's my exact sentiment. Yeah, they got him. Seriously? <laughs> oh my god, how did we let them get that? Find out in a couple days. Yep. Don't understand people who have major opinions about stuff they haven't seen. Yeah. I mean, my my main concern is, like, with changes as sweeping as what they've said is going to be happening. I'm always worried there's going to be, like, little edge cases that Blizzard, like, forgets to account for. That'll end up just, like, decimating or super overpowering certain heroes in certain situations. But I, I mean, we'll see. We'll have to wait and see. Who knows? Maybe this will be like a patch that actually ends up being really good. Perhaps this is the way it was meant to be all along. Come on. 
Need to see you'll get the Bebop skins. Also, hello, Marcus. Welcome. Yeah. Oh, man. I think the Bebop skins are the thing I'm most excited for in Season 9. Elder Chorus slaps so far. Yeah, it'll be an exciting theme. They patch quick after launch if something's broken. I'm sure they aim to. But with all the layoffs and stuff, uh, I, I guess we'll see how quick they're able to respond at this point. Hopefully it hasn't impacted them too much in that regard, but eh, we'll see. Welcome to the stream. Then comp is going to be fun for casual players who grinded for months and now they can't get the new stuff. Yeah. I don't know. I, the, the, the change to the weapons is uh, the gold weapons and the new jade weapons. I like that they're adding new weapon options. I just don't like that it's going to be such a pain to get the gold ones now. Also, the jade ones aren't very appealing to me and don't seem to be very appealing to many people from what I've seen. So, yeah. Oh yeah, no new map. I keep forgetting about that. Yeah, no new map. Hmm. blue sapphire guns. Yeah, I think those would be cooler, but that's just because I like blue. Hey, Astro, welcome to the stream. San Francisco versus Kansas City. Yeah, you're excited, Astro, aren't you? Dude, big game today. So exciting. Hello, SMGH. Welcome to the stream. I think the new weapons could look good with some skins, like Echo's Slime Queen skin. Yeah, the main problem I have with the Jade weapons is they feel too, like, <coughs> skin-specific. Like, gold, I think, goes with more, like, outfits and colors and aesthetics than shiny green does. Like, a lot more than shiny green does. So, like, jade weapons, it's like, I don't think they're gonna look that good on most skins, unless you're just wearing them because you're like, oh, I want to have, like, the cool thing that's 
you know, the cool flashy thing you show off, which, you know, a lot of people like that, and that's fair, but for me, it's like, eh, I'd rather have something that aesthetically looks nice. It's like the green metal, however green is, uh, lit that texture should have their eyes checked. <laughs> Whoever, I see, okay. Uh, I don't know, I mean, we'll see them in game and see what they look like, but yeah, from the stuff they've shown off, I'm not terribly impressed. What happens when you stick a hamster in it? What? Diamond or mystical would be better. Yeah, diamond would have been a cooler one that I think would have fit with more things. Give it a sort of like white or like bluish type tint. Get him, Echo. Alright. Jade looks good on Doom, combining with the red and blue effect. Yeah, they, they showed off the Doom Jade weapon in the uh, trailer, didn't they? <clears throat> Make Kirika wear a Raisin Cane's hat. Curious how will she work well? I've, I've thought about giving her different uh, types of hats. Fast food hats, I should specify. Of course, I've already given her a number of different hats, but... I feel like a Dunkin' Donuts hat would be appropriate for her. Assuming they'll uh, ever let her back into one of those establishments, but you know. Hello, Mouscarada. Welcome to the stream. At least the cowboy dad. Ian Donalds. <laughs> I should start my own fast food chain. Exclusively hire Kirikos. Oh, the Zen died. You think it was good they showed Venture, Space Ranger, Turtle Tank, or does it ruin surprise and hype? I kind of feel like it ruins the surprise and the hype. I mean, we'll see how it plays out. Because, you know, now people have, like, an expectation for them. They're going to be, like, excited and like, oh, I can't wait to get Venture. Well, like, at the same time, it does just obliterate any of that sort of speculation type stuff that we used to always have for new heroes. I mean, we can still speculate about their abilities. And we don't really know much about the turtle tank, so... Hmm. 
Oh my god. Behold the children of Ekimal. So unbelievably confused by the whole system? What do you mean, what whole system? Alright. What's your favorite skin in Overwatch? I don't know. Sukajin, probably. Love when Overwatch adds random new currencies. You find it funnier than it should be. IDK. I think we are at five with another that doesn't currently exist. Yeah. Yeah. They were like, ah, new currency, new currency, new currency. You get a new currency. You get a new currency. You get a new currency. A new currency. It's uh, kind of ridiculous. Tank gonna bring the DMD collab. <laughs> Hell yeah. I don't think I've ever seen someone suggest that for Overwatch. But yeah, Fortnite just got the TMNT collab. Let's go. Let's get one in Overwatch too. All you know about next season is that you'd like to have a conversation with whoever thought universal HP increases would be a good idea. A conversation involving a metal bat. Hmm. Why ask questions when you could just obey? I don't know what you're talking about, Marcus. Tsukajin just looks nice. Your macho would be a good shredder. Yeah. Yeah, he could have like normal shredder and then super shredder for his nemesis form. Doesn't play the stream live automatically. Yeah, I've noticed that before. Sometimes YouTube, when you join a stream that's already in progress, it'll just start you like a certain ways behind. It's really annoying, and I don't know why it does it. 
I mean, I'm assuming it has to be like a bug. There's no way that's intentional. Hey, Proto, how's it going? Proto, are you excited for the big game today? Oh, it's so exciting. Everyone's hyped. Biggest day of the year. Yeah, this, uh, this ain't happening. Hmm. It seems I lost my balance. It's hand. Talk to your visor activated. Heat check affirmative. Yeah, Astro, that, that explains the hamster comment. I wasn't quite sure what you had meant initially, but you know. Back here. Oh my god, how is this guy getting away? <laughs> oh my. What the? Where did the Doomfist come from? What's your favorite skin in Season 9 besides the Mythic Moira skin? Hmm. Uh, probably the Life Weaver skin, just because <laughs> I find it so funny. Winston swap. We'll see how that works out for them. Oh, come on. Their life weaver has been so pesky. Man, that actually got a lot closer than I was expecting it to.
Regardless of context or statement about the universal HP increase stands. I don't know. I mean, maybe there's stuff we haven't seen about it yet. Do you want to see the Bebop skins? Yeah, me too. Hello, the one person. Welcome to the stream. Good to see ya. Genji is Leo, Kiriko is Raph, Torb is Donnie, and Brig is Mikey. They just all get turtle skins? Like, what would those even look like? <laughs> You're playing yesterday, and even in his weakened state, Malga is still, like, crack to you. Yeah, I mean, his play style is the same, even if he's weaker. Torb turtle skin. There you go. That, that somehow feels more fitting. Yeah, it could just be cheap TMNT Halloween costumes. <laughs> Hey, Moustache, welcome to the stream. Welcome. So hype for the Deadpool 3 trailer. I thought there already was a Deadpool 3. Hello, Double Edge, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Stay in sight, and I'll keep you safe. Show us some Samoan. I don't know. It wasn't working for me when I was trying to play him earlier. Hello, Daddy Chill. Welcome to the stream. Taking a small break from Overwatch until Season 9 starts up. Eh, fair enough. Although, if you're a competitive player, maybe you don't want to take a break because you're going to miss out on getting some gold and weapons, potentially. At least until 2025. Surprised that hook actually landed. That looked like it was gonna miss. It's weird that they keep trying to give heroes twin flamethrowers and they keep changing their minds. Yep. They Over just there. can't commit to the flamethrower. Too scared. They're terrified of its power.
<sighs> Sayonara. Hey Anthony, welcome to the stream. Safety's off. It's a cruel world out there. You had Whataburger for lunch. <laughs> Somehow I feel like Kiriko's not like opposed to other fast food chains. She could not care less. She's just in it for the money. Hello, Brick Temple. Welcome to the stream. Definitely planned that 100%. <laughs> Name a car for an edit? I don't know what that means. the Dunkin Donuts doesn't burn down she's cool hey they, they won't even let her into Dunkin Donuts anymore and I think she'd prefer if I didn't talk about that whole incident Coming up with Super Bowling name of his stream, uh, mentioned that your home team lost their shot at the Super Bowl. Hopefully 49ers win tonight. Mm. Well, shame about your home team, but yeah, let, let, let's go team that's going to win. Woo! I'm so excited. About time.
So the video posted for Moira's Mythic skin looks really good. Yeah, it does look pretty cool. Your favorite car? I don't think I already have a favorite car. Now traveling to Petra. Did you steal from Krispy Kreme? Ah, uh, not just Krispy Kreme. Donkey Donut incident of 1987. More like 2077. Yeah, she's not allowed in Krispy Kreme either, so, uh, yeah. Should endorse. To Always forget to endorse. Your your hero. <laughs> Sports ball watchers when the ball goes carry go wow face. Wow. Presume you don't sit too much in VTubers, but have you heard of uh, Selen Tatsuki termination drama? Nope. Uh, I, I know bits and pieces about VTubers. That's not what I'm familiar with, though, whatever that drama is. A gun in each hand and a smile on my face. I've never been more ready for adventure. It's got a favorite car ad, huh? Appreciate it. Oh. Pregnant, never missed any of your videos. Much love from Texas. Oh, thank you, Yakoi. Congrats on the upcoming kid, I suppose. <laughs> Glad you enjoy the videos. Thanks for tuning into the stream. Hey, Tristavision, how's it going? How's my day going? Uh, not great. I'm tired, uh, and my microwave broke, so I haven't eaten today, and I'm pretty hungry, but you know, it's all right, we'll, we'll get through. At least the big game's later today. Oh, man, I'm so excited for the big game. The team's going to fight the other team. Oh, it's going to be awesome. Biggest day of our lives. Oh, dear. There you go, yeah. Give bro you act to make donuts. <laughs> He's done it before. Guy Life Weaver. Nah. Yeah, Life Weaver ain't working. Um, their tracer is being real annoying. Goofy 20 minute car thing from the 70s? Uh, I don't remember. Okay. 
Where is the bowling? Bowl starts later. Big game ain't for another few hours yet. That's why I'm still streaming and not at the big game. Well, this is going even better than Malga. As a European Super Bowl is pretty much expect movie trailers when you wake up. Yeah. <laughs> it's big commercial day. Woo! They get a home run. Oh, yeah, they're going to be getting all the home runs, all the touchdowns, all the scores, all the dunks. It's going to be the biggest game of our lives, man. It's so exciting. Oh, I know what you're talking about, Astro. Yeah, the... the uh, the, like, how to survive a, like, foreign assassination attempt video. I know what you're talking about. Trace is real toxic with her being super hyper. Yep. <laughs> How many golden guns do you have? Uh, I have every golden weapon for every tank, plus Brig, Kiriko, Zenyatta, Bastion, and I might be forgetting one. There might be another damage hero I have a gold for that I can't remember. Ryan here. That's actually not the worst idea. That could have been a good swap. Can't wait to hear which Eminem you're supposed to be angry about this time. Oh boy, I can't wait, yeah. Can't wait for all the outroars. Parents like to make homemade pizza for the Super Bowl. Pizza. I mean, I'd never turn down a good pizza, but like that seems like an odd one for the Super Bowl. Hmm. 
my throne is where I say it is. Have I seen you before? It's possible. I've passed through Drunkatown once or twice. You're the one who kicked Red Ned in the wicker basket! <laughs> You look like a talented bunch. This should be quick. No mistakes. Hey, Izzy Jennifer, welcome to the stream. Oh, come on. What is this, 2016? Running a Grav Dragon? <laughs> Make the dough and the sauce, too, for the pizza. Wow, so that's like truly homemade pizza. That's impressive. Not American, so who's going to win the Super Bowl? Uh, dude, the best team is going to win. It's going to be awesome. I'm so excited. sure people didn't figure out grab dragon until 2018 no no people knew about that one early that was one of the like og like meta comps that people complained about oh grab dragon op uh. oh come on butter bubble is gonna time out by then
Hey, Taro, welcome to the stream. Good to see ya. Hope you're having a good one, too. Remember it being rare because Hanzo was just plain awful? No! Hanzo wasn't awful in the early days. People hated him. He was like the OG hero everyone hated. Now your team is doing well. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> Way to go, Sombra. Woo. <laughs> Ah, oh, those bat caps, they'll never get old. Relax Sunday, just getting through the rain. Well, that's good to hear. You're not American, so I doubt you're excited for the big game, but you know, it's, uh, it's still an awesome day regardless. Oh yeah, Bastion was also hated in the early days, that's true. Bastion and Hanzo. Remember the whole tree trunks meme with Hanzo shooting logs and all that? That was pretty early. Way my knife. Woo. Dang, life weaver. Where were these grips earlier? <laughs> I did not hear the timing down for that one. Not that it would have mattered, they would have just had to kill me. You know, if you guys just stay up till 4 a.m. to watch it, wow. <laughs> I mean, I guess, yeah, there are probably some people outside America who are into the Super Bowl. Don't forget the goats meta. Uh, goats was a lot later though. That was that was post Brig, so that was like 2018, 2019 that that became a thing. And Beyblade meta, yeah, that wasn't as prominent as like any of the other ones, but that was a thing for a bit in the early days. Hey, confused Cabal. Member for six months. Thank you so much for your dedication. Very much appreciated. They added bowling to Overwatch. That's super. Indeed it is, Cabal. We're out here bowling the big game. Pre-gaming and Overwatch 2 live.
saw Beyblade the other day and couldn't stop laughing. Thought it was a dead combo. <laughs> I mean, it still works in a lot of situations. It's a technique that hasn't really been hindered by 5v5 that much, so... The release of Brig was basically the BCAD split for Overwatch 1. BCAD? What is that, some sort of like logic puzzle? What are, what are you bringing math into my chat? What is this, Astro? What are you up to? We need Hammond bowling now in Overwatch. Ugh. I wish. We need Hammond in Overwatch, period. God, I miss Wrecking Ball. Hello, Pierre. Welcome to the stream. Oh, I see what you mean. Just BCAD. I was looking at that as like, <laughs> like DNA strand sequencings. <laughs> You know what? I never considered that B C A D is the first four letters of the alphabet. Oh yeah, I knew it wasn't straight up DNA sequencing, but I thought it was that type of thing where it's like, oh yeah, these are the things used to identify the Quingloon protozoans, which are part of the amygdala genomes and some weird biology thing. I was like, I don't know what that is. It's all just ligaments and quasars as far as I know. All right, you asked for it. It's time to ape escape their ass. A better world is possible today. Still force ball. Haven't cared about rank or wins in a long time. Ugh, you can't just force ball though, because like he just gets stomped. ADBC can be used to find uh, the determinant of a metric, though. See, there you go. Sciencey mumbo jumbo. Never thought I'd ever hear ligaments and quasars mentioned in the same sentence. I don't know. It's all this stuff. Words. Do they mean anything? Maybe. I'm sure, they mean something to someone. playable nowadays is to have them in Fortnite. <laughs> uh, I wish they'd add buff Hammond to Fortnite already. What are they waiting for?
All right, well, I don't think we quite need monkey anymore. We can swap it up to go diva to take that high ground. Mercy just spamming the Glock. <laughs> Got your Astra and you got your biology with quasars and ligaments, so I suppose you're the guy. Yep, see, there you go. You're the world's leading uh, mind when it comes to ligaments and quasars. Ryan, how did you die to that? Stay dead, Ryan. Can't believe you killed Nutsack. Well, let's be honest, Nutsack had it coming. Sorry. Oh, come on. God damn it. Shall we? Man, I haven't played Reinhardt in ages. This will be fun. Oh yeah, I forgot I had the hard light weapon on for him. No, not the back door. But Eva's reminding you you were studying with your friend last night and she had decided to put up like a million K-pop posters around her dorm and the vibes were just absolutely wretched. Mm. Score. Two. Zero. Sides. Yeah, I've, I've never been one for the, the old K-pop vibes personally, must admit. Love when Ryan tries to run you off a cliff when you're still in your mech. 
I mean, depending on at what point he pins you, you can still die to that <laughs> if he goes... Assuming he goes with you. He can take you all the way down. It's a similar feeling with Wrecking Ball, where it's like, they try to run you off, and then you just grapple back up when they fall to their death. <laughs> That's always been fun. <laughs> Hey, Vladimir, welcome to the stream. Notorious M.I.G. Well, it's not M.I.V.G. He's, uh, he's still on house arrest, so uh, he probably won't be showing up anytime soon. Tried. I will break. Now, do you see your error? Hello. Stop it. You're playing team deathmatch one day. Ryan tried to ran, uh, run the Kirik off a cliff. She just teleported back. And the Ryan died. Yeah, I've seen that happen before too. Hell, I've done that as Kiriko. <laughs> like, nope, I'm just gonna come back. Saw chat Kiriko's Reddit account in the wild the other day. It was so weird. I've seen it too, yeah. <laughs> Funny you mentioned that. I mean, they were the one that posted the uh, Moira leak on Reddit. Well, one of them at least. Not as the source, but as someone who was talking about it. Too slow, Zen. Couldn't save your student. His blood is on your hands. Now! The Moira leak was actually a pretty big legal debacle. 
I mean, that's what happens when someone breaks an NDA. The Moira leak was just her mythic skin got leaked like the day before the trailer went out. I think most people probably saw it, but if you missed it, that's all it was. <laughs> Come on, Reaper, you got this. Oh, come on. Uh, maybe Malga would have been the better swap at the end there. Play of the game. And Ramatra just doesn't feel nearly as strong. Only good for punching through Genji Deflect now. No, I'm not winning. 
The sun is not pleasing any father, be it my own or anyone else's. You should play Ramatra's Tempo Tank. What does it mean? <laughs> Ramatra's our first Tempo Tank. Ball stares intently. Now arriving at ease. Ah, back on support. Let's go. Can't wait to contribute nothing. Not your day for comp, no. It doesn't help that I'm starving, but you know, it's, uh, whatever. Ah, oh, fight through the pain. I'll find my own path. Look at the state of the world. Was it Arisa the first tempo tank, technically? Uh How was Arisa a tempo tank? Remember, I'm not sure I see that one. <laughs> yeah, Kiriko, be useful. Go get me some food. <laughs> Do have anything in the house besides what needs to be microwaved? I mean, I do, but I can't just stop the stream to go eat. Why was it only me? <laughs> Lucio, the first, first tempo support. <laughs> there you go. At least that one would make sense. <laughs> Was all an elaborate ruse to make them overconfident. Now we have the point. On the wind. Bastion is tempo DPS. Exactly.
get an air fryer. I should get an air fryer. I know a lot of people that have them and they all really like them. What? Name one support that isn't hot. Uh, no comment. Shouldn't have put your head there. <laughs> Holy moly, I can't believe we actually pulled that back. Seeing Mauga run at you like a steel mill of legs is hilariously terrifying. <laughs> Certainly something. Y'all just haven't seen Tentacle Moira? Oh no! <laughs> Moira! What are you doing with those tentacles? Moira, no! <laughs> I haven't played this season because the idea of playing with or against Malga uh, seems painful. Ah, it's not that bad. I think people were over emphasizing the pain of Malga. Not that bad. Playing Risa on this map, it's fun to boot, boot people off the map. <clears throat> yeah. It's, I used to love playing ball on this map. It's so easy to knock people off the side of the lighthouse. Still think Mauga's amazing? Yeah, I mean, he, he is. Your visor activated. 
Better run, Frogman. Rule 34 of Overwatch is Ouroboros never ending. Luke, what? I mean, it may be eternal in a sense, but like. Love playing tempo tank and temping everywhere. <laughs> Yeah, I love to just tempo around. Playing with Malga in a match is a never-ending wild ride. Malga versus Malga. Oh my god, that is my least favorite matchup out of anything ever. Nilios and Li Zhang are amazing ball maps. Oh, Li Zhang Tower is so good for wrecking ball. Love Malga v Malga fights where they stop everything and stand completely still and just lovingly stare each other down while shooting and never dying. Yeah, it's uh, something all right. Like building two factories next to each other and just letting them operate for 10 million years. Exact same type of energy. Yeah, both Faris Cute and Pixel Sprays on Ilios in the same game. Nice. <laughs> I probably don't have Farah's sprays, now that I think about it, because I never play her. Hmm. Give Malga a go. A gun in each hand and a smile on my face. You look like a talented bunch. This should be quick. Time to break some hearts. I wish violence never solved anything. It would oh, be so much easier. Hey, buddy. Alright, who are we fighting against? Careful, Life Weaver. There's no one here to grab you. I think Life Weaver grabs people because deep down he wants to be grabbed himself, but he knows nobody ever will. That was a thing. <laughs> Apple Crab Life Weaver, if you know what I mean. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. just had to run out of ammo, didn't I? Ah, it's always with the ammo. Appreciate it. 
What's funnier than watching two enormous dudes stand there unloading ridiculous damage into each other and laughing maniacally as their HP doesn't change? I mean, I, I can think of a, a number of things, but... <laughs> fight is so ass <laughs> ever since they nerfed the infinite ammo it's it's just awful <laughs> an alga run should slowly reload his gun there you go i'm down for that hey chat kiriko welcome to the stream someone was just talking about you earlier Yeah, cage fight, like, just literally doesn't do anything. Because it's like... Like, genuinely, at this point, what is the purpose of it? What is it supposed to do? Oh, it traps a single person so you can kill them? Alright, the rest of the enemy team just piles in to save the person. And you just die instead, because now you're trapped as well. So it's like, oh, you're supposed to use it to pick off a single person. Trap a single person. Well, if it's a single person, you don't need to trap them because you've outnumbered them and you're going to win that fight anyways. <laughs> it, it doesn't serve any purpose. It's just like a really terrible temporary barrier that hinders you while using it. Oh, it's so bad. Cage fights fun in deathmatch. I imagine it would be. Oh, I didn't see your Matrid walk behind me. Cage fight is one redeeming factor. The voice line, yeah, that, that's the only good thing about it is the voice line. <laughs> You're literally saved by voice acting. Wish you could say the same about Kiriko. Astro and Proto introduced you to the Malgatorb ult called the Cumjar. Oh yeah, Cumjar is a fun one. Like, I guess Cage Fight can be good if you combo it like that, but... Honestly, I, I just feel like nobody ever does. Yeah, it's literally just the worst grab. See, look, I have a barrier now. Wah ha 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 ha. I 
if you could at least charge inside the barrier, I think that would like give it some more value. So you can sort of like try to knock people down in a confined space like that, but it disables your ability to charge, which is just like, okay, further hinder him. One consistent use you've got is to contain uh, ults like Death Blossom and Self Destruct. Yeah, but that usually means that you just end up dying with it then. Like. <laughs> it's just a throw yourself on the grenade type ult then. Which is not a good use for an ultimate. <laughs> change the charge into another ability inside the barrier so the no movement is consistent but there's still something yeah i don't know if they'd need to do that maybe if they just gave him some other like personal buff while it was active the infinite ammo was like the thing that made it actually like good because it's like oh even if you don't trap anyone still you can just be an infinite ammo powerhouse while using it but now it's like, oh, if you don't trap anyone, you're literally just hindering yourself with your own ultimate. Alka so would have been amazing in 6v6 with another tank. <sighs> Only ever dream. You look like a selected bunch. This should be quick. If only there was a way to have two tanks in a team. Hmm. Bastion. Guess we gotta go for the Mixeroni. Matra knows how to kite. Saw a thing where someone remade 6v6 with all the new heroes. Yeah, there have been a number of sort of fan-made things like that.
god. At least we pulled him from high ground. Maybe if we get back in time, they won't have regrouped. There we go. Ah, oh, thank God. Objective A. I watch. Enemy here. Escort the payload. Who's on fire? I am. Help me move the payload. Saw a post where someone claimed that they thought the Han, that Hanzo and Anna were together because of the "Honor is all I have left" voice line. Possibly the funniest thing ever, if true. What? Honor is all I have left? How would that insinuate those two being together? Now they're running. Oh, Anna is all I have left. I see. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure he just says honor. <laughs> There we go. All right, now we just gotta push it on through. Is this easy mode? Yeah. Come on. 
on. We're not gonna make it, are we? Fall. When the world needed you most, you appeared. <laughs> Man, this has been awful today, guys. <laughs> I don't even care anymore. I just want to play my ball. It's been too long. We ball. Hello, Pan Jack. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, it is our first rodent type tank. <laughs> rodent type. Like Pokemon, different types. <laughs> Why is our team holding so far back? I'm pretty sure gorillas are not a type of hamster. Just, uh, just 
just a strange hunch I got there. Real again, G. Real. Oh, there's people there. Of course they go Sombra. Of course, of course. Competitive, all right. <laughs> yeah, why wouldn't they go Swarm, bro? <sighs> you know what? For a long time, I was like, I don't want them to rework Ball. I know they're going to ruin him. It's reached the point where like, I just don't even care anymore. He's like unplayable as is. Just rework him already. Just put his ball mode on a cooldown. Good way to deal with the Sombra Ball matchup is to just make it so it clocks him into whatever form he's currently in. Yeah, because that's how it works with Bastion, right? He doesn't get kicked out of his assault form. You have ideas for rework? I don't know. Just make them viable. <laughs> Reaper sniper rifle, what? Hey, Titanium Pro, welcome to the stream. You win any games? A uh, few. What do you think about Reaper getting a rework and what, uh, what do you think it might be? I don't know what they're gonna do with Reaper. I almost feel like it's gonna turn out to be another Moira rework where it's like they talk about doing it for a long time and iterate a lot of things and then ultimately just don't end up changing them because they can't find anything that like works.
feel like the viability issues aren't a flaw in his design, it's the environment. Well, yeah, but... I mean, in a way, those are the same thing. Where it's like, yeah, design-wise, he's fine. There's just too many other factors that just neuter him as a hero. Where he's just worthless. Give him a Suzu-like ability that only works on himself so he doesn't get annihilated by every status known to humankind. Yep. Or, you know, they could just delete Sombra from the game. That, that works, too. I'm not afraid of you, One Fist. Give him a smaller hamster ball and move him to be DPS. Oh, I'd hate that. But I guess then I would actually have a damage hero that I enjoy playing, so. Only Reaper change will be that he can throw his shotguns a long distance, now dealing damage to enemies. Yes, Sombra Slander. She says, if you have many aliases, why call yourself Sombra and Ball cannot coexist. One of them has to go, and it ain't gonna be the hamster. Can you build me a bike? Make Pow Driver do as much damage as Remac. <laughs> oh my god, just make it devastating. <laughs> Reaper can now throw us a mask as a boomerang. <laughs> you know what? I'm surprised the Junker Queen doesn't have a skin yet where her knife is a boomerang. Like, what a bizarre thing for them to just not, like, do. Ooh, they really don't like the hamster. Gee whiz, somebody gotta push the payload! Reaper could take off his mask and it shocks the enemy so much that they're stunned for 10 seconds like the comic. <laughs> Over here. 
150 HP Sombra. I feel like they should sort of push her in that sort of direction. Where she focuses on taking less damage. Make her squishier. Easier to stamp out like the bug she is. Skin you most excited for in season nine? Probably the Life Weaver one, just because I think it's so funny. <laughs> Let's see about winning this. Why isn't the payload moving? I hit him. <laughs> Man, I actually had really good damage on Wrecking Ball. <laughs> God damn. Look at that. <laughs> he finally leveled up after all this time. Oh, 
Oh, how I miss seeing that little ball icon. Hammy boy. And we got level 20 for D.Va last night. Hey, congrats. What is my highest at this point? How high is Kiriko? 25. Okay. Higher than I was thought it was. Now entering King Row. Prepare to attack. Select your hero. Got ball to level 30. Wow. Play him a lot then. My throne is where I say it is. Our group energy is interesting. Yeah, very interesting. Nah. We are in hard Have you noticed an increase in Genji players, Smurfs, and general toxicity this season? Um, I can't honestly say that I have. In this world, pacifism is foolish. What makes you think I am a pacifist? You sure talk like one. Perhaps it is assumptions that are... Goddamn, Astra. How did you hit 45 on Malga? That's insane. You don't even play this game. <laughs> Played some queen the other day and didn't too too bad with her. Well, that's good to hear. Honestly, hey, Junker Queen's probably the tank I have the most fun on these days. Uh oh, enemy Sukajin. Single-minded passion, uh-huh, yeah. I feel like there's a, a more official term for that, but... Sure, we'll leave it at single-minded passion. levels of pure pain on Rhine. Oof. Why do you do that to yourself? Honor die with glory. <laughs> be 
He's certainly doing one of those two things. An awful lot, I assume. <laughs> Junker Queen just like holds the shotgun single handed. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna run around single hand firing a shotgun, which I, I guess a lot of shotgun heroes do. Reaper does that technically. Roadhog, too, but like, I don't know. Something about this like bizarro makeshift cannon she just has. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna hold it in my hand. Last time our Hanzu was named Dudu Crumb, and now our Kiriko, or the enemy Kiriko is full Crumb. It's all these Crumb players. Death is a mistake to be learned from. <laughs> You've learned a lot this year. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I guess she does, but like, that's a bit different, because that's like a, just like she whips it out to blast it. It's not like, ah, yes, yeah, single hand, holding a shotgun steady. Like, do you have any idea how hard it would be to just hold a shotgun like the Queen's aloft, let alone fire it repeatedly? <laughs> She's got them big muscles. People like her for a reason. Queen looks like a Borderlands character. Yeah, she definitely has that sort of vibe. Maybe it's made out of aluminum. Uh, I kind of doubt it. Because <laughs> it would probably explode if she used it and it was made out of aluminum. Queen is that step on me energy. Uh -huh, she most certainly does. Well, I still enjoy her. Hero with a classic double barrel like Doom. Hmm. Yeah, I guess you could say Roadhogs is kind of like that. It's, it's like not really, because it's like a makeshift weapon, but yeah.
Alrighty. Mm. Bee junk or queen skin? Queen bee skin? Huh. I could see it. Hate Bastion, he's so annoying. He just requires particular measures to deal with. Uh, okay. Has to fire both shells at once and have a super satisfying reload. this again. Back to the Future collab. Oh man, that'd be wild. <laughs> Yeah, Marty McFly Tracer. That would totally be what they do. That would be so much fun. Uh, who'd be Doc Brown? I feel like Junkrat would be Doc Brown, but he already has that skin, basically. DeLorean Bastion. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Hmm... Winston Doc Brown. <laughs> there you go. Skullcore, welcome to the stream. No, not Fortnite today. Overnut. Would be Biff. <laughs> I feel like Soldier might be Biff. <laughs>
a suspended for spamming links. Uh, did you type diva? Because that'll do it. Is Nightbot being pesky again? Hmm. On the subject of Nightbot, I'm actually looking to get a new moderation bot going on my streams. One which might have just a bit more of a friendlier face. Hello, legend. Welcome. Kiriko is Marty, then her fox could be Einstein. There you go. It's been a while, legend. I gonna say, I didn't think I'd seen you in a while. Heading off one person. Thanks for stopping by the stream. Have a good one. Back to the Future is one of those properties where people only really care about like two characters in the props. Yeah, basically. Their tracer is nuts, so. Hey, Dragon Claw, welcome to the stream. Hey Playing a lot and watching a lot of PAL World. Usually don't like survival games, but the one is much simpler. It's also the most bizarre game you've ever seen. Yeah, it's been uh, quite the hot topic game, hasn't it? Just gotta push it all the way to the end like they did. No biggie.
Hmm. I'm gonna run the Bastion again, but like. Are you already heading off, Legend? Well, no worries. Have a good one. We must all find the cause we're fighting for. Stay inside. Your boyfriend is the Back of the Future Lego set. Ah, oh, cool. I remember seeing that back when it came out, and I was tempted to get it, but I never did. Bad Wi-Fi Ramatro buffer as I have. The new Nightbot could be called Rem, not Ram. Not Ram as in like, Ramatra is the new Nightbot? Or is it like a Rem sleep night sort of joke? Interesting. The Malga swap, curious. Not expecting them to do that. Hey, Dragon Call, the $20 super chat. Thank you so much. There's games that take themselves very seriously, somewhat seriously, don't take themselves seriously, and refuse to take themselves seriously. Pal World takes the fact that it doesn't take itself seriously, seriously. Free 20. <laughs> uh, very hey. succinctly put. Look, Mom, I'm obviously the most precious. Thank you for the $20 super chat, Dragon Call. Yeah, um, that's 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 a way to put it, I guess you could say. I'm surprised I haven't deranked yet. Oh, 
Oh, who do we attempt to play this time? Might as well. My throne is where I say it is. No mistakes, no mercy. Think you can keep up? <laughs> you ever think about how interesting it is that like little things can cause such monumental changes? Like my microwave broke this morning. So I haven't eaten today, therefore my gameplay is suffering horribly, and I'm losing all my matches, and I might derank and not finish the season at its diamond, which means I won't get enough competitive points to get one more golden weapon before the year-long downtime. It's always fascinating how things can snowball. Won't let you see your Sukajin. <laughs> what the hell is that supposed to mean? <laughs> what sort of bizarro euphemisms are you whipping around here? Yeah, butterfly effect. Exactly. Someday I'll be able to write a novel about how my microwave breaking led to me not being able to get Space Ranger's golden weapon. And I'll be able to track every single sequence of that entire event. I don't have any pop tarts. Wow, okay. <laughs> Microwave any hamsters. <laughs> Stop saying that. I would never do that to Hammond, my beloved little friend. Kiriko broke the microwave. Maybe she did. Maybe she was worried that... <laughs> Maybe she knew if she broke the microwave, I wouldn't be able to eat today, and then I'd do poorly in my competitive matches, and I wouldn't be able to afford enough to get a golden weapon for the entire next year, which would prevent me from becoming a Space Ranger main. She's seen into the future. She knows what happens. <laughs> I can't stand the idea of someone else replacing her as my support main. Will you make a second Space Ranger speculation video? Uh, I might. 
I've thought about doing like hero concept videos for Space Ranger and Venture. At this point, it's probably a bit too late to do one for Venture. Maybe not. But maybe I'll do one for Space Ranger if I can muster the willpower to do it. Ooh. No. <laughs> you know how the YouTubers often do uh, give this video X amount of likes and I'll do this for a video? Why don't you do something like that? Because those are like really lowbrow like. And they're not really effective. They're very like cheap ways of gaining temporary like viewership and likes. They don't really grow your channel in any meaningful way. Also, what am I gonna do? Like, oh, haha! Ha, I'll say the alphabet backwards. Like, I, like, what am I? Well, what am I supposed to do? Play only Genji for an entire day? Wow, that'd be so much fun. I don't know. I mean, I'd have to come up with something interesting to actually do if it's like, give me X likes. If you get this stream to a hundred thousand likes, I'll. Do a Kiriko cosplay, I don't know. <laughs> Kiriko's jelly of Space Ranger thinking she's cuter than her, so she caused the butterfly effect. <laughs> she probably is worried. terrified that they'll end up releasing a Space Ranger Nendoroid and then it'll only be a matter of time until Space Ranger's here on all the streams instead of Kiriko. <laughs> it's go time. Well, as long as Space Ranger doesn't have anything that can compete with Sukujin, I don't think Kiriko has anything really to worry about. Personally, I think a game uh, picked by the community would be cool. Oh, for a stream. I'm curious what game would get picked. I'd be, see, I'd be worried it'd be a game like Pal World, and it's like, okay, I just sit there for three hours playing Pal World. And like, how interesting would that even end up being? Oh my god. Space Ranger might be the cutest Overwatch 2 hero yet. We've barely even seen her. How can you say that? What if her personality is even worse than Kiriko's? <laughs> the total slap in the face. Who you got winning the Super Bowl tonight? Uh, the better team. I think they're going to win. Only 
who struggle to eat survive. One more mission, huh? I'm in. Funko Brig can host a stream. Ugh, how many times do we have to tell you? <laughs> Funko Pop Brig can't host streams. She doesn't even have a mouth. She can't talk. Face to the face. Over here. Over here. Over here. Five, four, three, two, two, one. Attack. Hammond can host. Hammond can't talk either. <laughs> Maybe we'll just get the mech to host. Thank you, Life Weaver. Bet she has a glide ability falling with style. <laughs> you know she's gonna have Buzz Lightyear references. Think Space Ranger is gonna have an early 2000s manic pixie dream girl personality. Ooh, do you think they're brave enough to do that? That would, honestly, that'd be a nice change of pace for characters in Overwatch. I don't know if they're brave enough to do it though. Ugh, I just want the brig to die, please. How long have you been playing Overwatch? You've been playing uh, since Bastion had his shield, Reese was a new hero, and New Limits was the standard competitive game mode. Uh, I mean, I've been playing since the launch. Bastion hasn't had his shield since the, uh... Was that even in the alpha? Was... That, that must have been the, uh, like, public... private beta? If even. Bastion didn't have his shield by the time the game launched. I forget when exactly it got cold, though. Personality will be better than Alarian Sojourn. Don't forget Kiriko. There we go. Finally, the tomboy is dead at long last.
<laughs> How did she survive that? <laughs> I mean, in the end, she didn't, but... Dang, she gets her ult so much. Uh, Life Weaver, you numb skull. Yeah, talk about big pull for the enemy team. Good lord. Favorite indie game? Um, does Subnautica count as an indie game? Imagine it might. Oh, there's Spelunky. That's a game I loved back in the day. Indie game. Um, hmm. I'm trying to think of other big indie games I've played that I really liked. Better find my subjects up to no good. They always get soft when I'm not around. Ooh, a hat in time. That definitely is considered an indie game. That's a really good one. I feel like the best thing about indie games, more often than not, is their soundtracks. <laughs> Satisfa Satisfactory is considered an indie game? That's made by uh, Coffee Stain, though. I mean, if they're considered indie, then Sanctum 2 would probably be my favorite indie game, because they made that game, too. today. These people really are just uh, doing what they want. Oh yeah, Undertale of course is definitely a big one. <laughs> yeah, technically I guess Minecraft started as an indie game. I certainly wouldn't call it that now, but... I mean, I guess you could say Overwatch is an indie game. I mean, Blizzard's a small indie company, right? <laughs> Got beat to the punch, P. Daddy. Good 
Like how we just like wandered to the far other side of the map and the enemy just kept fighting us over there. You have a Hat in Time t-shirt, nice. What's the graphic on it? It's just like the Hat Kid? of hat girl and some hourglasses okay yeah Who are you fighting, Lucio? Oh, it's the other supports. God. Okay. Nobody else is going to stop the ball than I will. Maybe you should play ball. <laughs> oh, I'm tempted. He's no one of them is going to go somber, though.
There we go. Finally. Thank you. Hello, Jejo Pads. Welcome. Haven't seen you in a while. Hope you've been doing well. What? How did that collide with the wall there? Of course. So close to alt. One of them's gonna have to touch it. Genji, you're the only one. Uh, never leave anything to a Genji. Had an Overwatch burnout, but uh, you're well. How about me? Well, today's been pretty awful, but you know, the big games later, so that's exciting. You're going to be grinding to level 200? Oof. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I don't think I'm going to be hitting 200. Even with the double XP weekend. Posted a video of Malgo and Switch at the Discord. Uh, no, I don't think I saw it. Got hit in the face by platform shoes. Hmm. That sucks, Nines. What'd you do to make him kick you?
never grinded to 200 for any of the seasons. I mean, it's just a title. Not the biggest thing in the world. Not when we got other things to do. Oh dear. No. No. How old do you think Space Ranger and Venture will be? I think Space Ranger will be the first ever teen kid hero. No, they're definitely both going to be adults. They wouldn't have kids in the game, because then that raises a bunch of questions about, like, oh, you're running around shooting children? Like, yeah, no, there aren't going to be any underage characters that are playable heroes in Overwatch. Excited for the Battle Pass video? Well, stay tuned. I don't think Evie was controversial. It's just a reason why she was never going to be a hero. She was a kid. Ari's 18. 18's an adult. Eighteen, she looks twenty-seven. Yeah, surviving a nuclear explosion. That'll 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 do that to you. Make you look a bit older. It is weird that Alara is younger than Diva. Technically, Lara is younger than D.Va ever was in terms of being a playable hero. D.Va was 19 back in Overwatch 1. For that. My ultimate is 
<laughs> that flower petal didn't save him that time. Watch them bring it back and we lose this match too. Just you wait. What does Kiriko think of her pink skin? I think she wishes it had the fox headband on it still. Lari's like three years younger than Kiriko, but you don't see Soldier telling her to act her age. Yeah, that's because uh, despite their ages, one of them is a lot less mature than the other. <laughs> Lari's suffered as much as Ramatra has. <laughs> has she, though? Has anyone suffered as much as Ramatra has? Then Kirika suffered as her donuts and family and Sukajin shorts. What? I don't know about that one. Ari accidentally sun nuked her people. Nah, get over it. She sneezed and everyone died. <laughs> I hope that's like the canon actual event. For like three minutes, she had like super sun god powers, and then she sneezed and everyone just died. Kiriko did have to grow up with Genji and Hanzo, yeah. Look at that, we got a win, wow! Pretty sure it was more than a hundred people she killed, but like, yeah, same thing.
Brig suffered because Tor buffs his turret more. <laughs> I turret. Do you think that's why Torbjorn loves Bastion so much? He's just a turret with pseudo sentience. It really makes you think, doesn't it? Why ask questions when you could just obey? Follow the rules and we will be fine. Uh, P. Daddy, the implication I got was that she killed everyone. I don't think it was just the warriors. I mean, unless that's something they delve into more in, like, the archive things. Like, the expanded lore. I think the idea is that she just literally killed, like, the entire city. Well, he got blown up. Somebody got to go up the junk. Net zero information. Well, Ari should become a secret agent. No one would ever be able to learn anything about her because she has no information. <laughs> surprisingly good match all of a sudden hmm I wonder if my hidden MMR suddenly dropped to plat at long last that's why we're getting matches we can win now
Okay. I can work with this. Sig is always meta, he just isn't getting played. That's, like, actually true, though. <laughs> Do we be brave? The brave little hamster. Do we be brave and throw it all away? I'm not relaxed, you're relaxed. I can't perform a checkup with you in the ball. Me wielding the lightning, the rise does to work. Negative. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes, Wu Ham indeed. Wu Ham D's nuts! Woo! Can't catch me! Hell's going on in here. Oh no! What happened to my rollout? Thank you, Mercy. Or is this going to be the Mars version? <laughs> or Space Ranger is going to be the Mars version of Alari? <laughs> oh man, what if they just start reusing backstories like that? Fine, we can play for realsies. Wait, did we get it? Come on, you guys can kill one spacey boy, right? If <laughs> enough anime plots for one Overwatch. <laughs> Kiriko diss track when? <laughs> I love trash. Welcome to the stream. I feel like Kiriko is just her own diss track. Where do you think space is from? Uh, Mars. Hooray, we're finally turning it around.
Yes, Mars is a country in Overwatch 2. If Space Ranger is Chinese, just watch them shoehorn in some relationship with May. Where it's like, oh, they're actually cousins. Because, of course, people can't be from the same country without being directly related to each other. What if there's an Overwatch Super Bowl ad? <laughs> they announced Overwatch 4. <laughs> we're skipping 3. That's how many steps we're taking forward. Alright, I think we've had enough hamster fun for one year. Let's play something serious. Speaking of Nightbot, why has... I guess Nightbot has been doing the regular things, the promotions. I feel like I haven't been seeing Nightbot much today. Maybe it's just because you all have been so active in chat, I don't know. I've been on Overwatch for a while now, taking a much needed break. Are you holding back here? What are you, you guys... No. <laughs> Thank you, Ash, for doing what I could. Because the new Torb skin looks, you're never taking Speedo Torb off. Oh, just you wait. One of these days, they'll release a Torb skin to top surf and splash. Just you wait. Stop sleeping me right as I throw out my little nanite sphere. Oh, 
That's uh, probably unnecessary. Oh well. I am grateful. Ah. <laughs> have to be a smaller speedo. <laughs> the only thing to beat Surf and Splash, a smaller speedo. By nines, hope you're feeling better. Maybe the real Super Bowl is the friends we made along the way. Nah, I'm pretty sure it's uh, the Super Bowl. This is the real Super Bowl. Can't believe you'll be 24 this year, starting to feel ancient. Well, it's the first step towards becoming a peak grandpa. We must all strive to be peak grandpa one day. What a joy it must be to feel entitled to patience. No, 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 no! <laughs> Well, things have certainly turned around, it seems, for the better. Play of the game. Mm, that's that's not a sus name at all. <laughs> Perfectly normal Ash main name. <laughs>
Oh man. What's going to happen when we get that next win? Assuming we do get a next win, of course. Where are all our challenges? Questions when you could just obey. The older I get, the faster the years go. It's likely that time is passing at the same rate it always has. <laughs> Barring relativistic effects, of course. I like you better when you are talking to yourself. Watch your eyes and see. Let's see. Mick Echo. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that one. I feel like, if anything, that'd be a one sided ship. That'd actually be an interesting one for them to play around with in the story. The idea of Echo having feelings for Cassidy. You know they'll never go there, but that would be an interesting thing to explore considering their characters. not the expected result <laughs> as echo says i'll try anything once <laughs> oh echo you have a lot to learn <laughs> Hello, impersonation. Welcome back.
Not hit anybody. <laughs> no, 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 stay away. Yeah, I think Mechecho is an interesting ship. It's not necessarily the one I would say should happen. But it certainly is an interesting one from like a character exploration standpoint. Highest rank you've ever had in comp, Diamond. Hey, Double Dump Day, how's it going? Alright, let's uh, do something a bit useful now. A better world is possible today. Pre-flight checklist complete. Running clean and hot. I don't know how you do it, Anna. Do what? Stay still for hours, waiting for the perfect shot. I don't know how you zip around without getting dizzy. Are they running? Still got that sim? Oh, is that a hog? I s no, it's Bastion. Sigma. Either way, uh, I don't know if Winston's gonna work here. Yee! They don't have the sim anymore, thank god. Hehehehe. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sigma died, that all matters. Alright, let's see. Let me see. Winston was hate doors. Yes, as a gorilla, he doesn't understand them. to pick the boring meta Arisa tank. <laughs> Whatever wins, right? God. Counter watch is the real tank game. Yeah, no kidding. A revelation was within my reach. Waste of their Valkyrie, but okay.
forces required to move the payload forward. The forbidden flux is upon us. There we go. There we go. Mm. Ugh. All it takes is a little comboing, eh? No one. So <laughs> As you play weird, what is that supposed to mean? Frig was so determined to kill me, he just ran to the dragons. Woohoo! Yippee! Want season 9 to be better than this? Oh, fingers crossed. the YouTube vids for Overwatch. Well, I'm glad you like them. You wish to ride me into battle? I... What a preposterous thought. Do not lie, Archer. It is beneath you. Hmm. Being hey. born of science. <gasps> seeking answers <gasps> in a cave. Five, My thanks. Four. Does not compute. <laughs> 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 Alright, good little lead here going. One more win. One more win. Hmm, Nerys of their own.
No! <laughs> Blasted across the mountain. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, what should I play here? I don't know, it might not be the pick, but let's let's uh try it. If you can outthink your opponent, it's easy to outfight them. These phenomena bear further investigation. Superior firepower is good, but superior brain power is better. Nay. Hmm. Strange fluctuations emanate through this space. Eva, okay. That brig could be a problem. No! Well, I broke her mech. Come on, come on, team. You can do it. Was there a miscalculation? Gotta do is hit him with the flux C9. No! 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 Yes! <laughs> Bigly Nano on Let's go! Come on, come on. Stay away. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Holy moly. Oh my god, that nano is the most clutch thing ever. <laughs> Good lord. Way to go, Anna. <laughs> 
Yeah, our tracer's doing well too. Hey, Peter, welcome back. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at all those swaps. The Overwatch 2 tanking experience. All right, what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? No! I knew it, I knew it'd be back to plat. Ugh. Damn. Oh, I think I'll do a few more. And then wrap up fairly shortly, but squeeze in a couple. Try to reclaim my diamond. Yeah, I failed my Sig-9 initially there, and then managed to charge it up again, and then do it again. And that was enough. Awkward demoted. We tried Pal World. No, I have not. It does not look like my type of game. Hmm. A gun in each hand and a smile on my face. Kokoyo, can't change the world by following all the rules. Nah. Have I played any other games recently? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I've just been spending a lot of my time playing this little known game known as Fortnite. You know, other than that, no. No, I haven't really been playing anything. Nope, still no better Malgaskins. They have yet to add any others. Oh 
Oscar's gun lives rent free in his head. <laughs> oh, that goddamn frenzy. <laughs> it's always Oscar's frenzy every goddamn time. <laughs> I've died to that thing more times than anything. <laughs> No! Oh, you went full turtle squad the other day in Fortnite? Dude, I've been enjoying using the Shredder skin. I have actually gotten a few wins with it at this point, even though I didn't when I was streaming the other day. Goodness. Trying to convince him to play Hell Divers. Yeah, that's a game that's like suddenly popped out of nowhere and everyone's talking about. Everyone's talking about Hell Divers now. It's the new PAL world. Is the new Among Us? Oh, come on. What's up? Keep in sight. I'll have us in and out in no time. Buzz off, Echo.
Oh dear. Kirik was smiling, how rare. What? It's not rare. <laughs> what a stupid interaction. <laughs> <laughs> you really try to sweep me on him. Really? Hmm, maybe I shouldn't have waken him up. Now still busted? Uh, not really. Ram. Yeah. 
All right, I want this to be a nice, clean victory. Just sat down and watched some cartoons. You wouldn't be so sad. There's a ninja called Genji. You probably used the dragon sword in the cartoon. <laughs> yeah, that is funny to think about. Oh, if you just paid attention. to do it. Alrighty, folks, I think that'll be a good place to end the stream for today, end on a win. After all, it is the big day. The big game's coming up very shortly. Don't want to be delayed in getting to my uh, event viewing thing, and I'm sure you all are too. So thank you, everybody who tuned into the stream for today. Quite a few people showing up. Always good to see you here. Thanks for the super chats as well. And I hope you all have a lovely Sunday. If you're uh, watching the big game, I hope your favorite team wins. And if not, well, I hope you just have a lovely normal day. So, on that note, take care. Goodbye. <laughs>